आगे बढ़ेंगे टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप से पहले टाइम्स नेटवर्क ने ऑस्ट्रेलिया की पूर्व तेज गेंदबाज ब्रैटली से खास बातचीत की इस दौरान उन्होंने इंडियन क्रिकेट टीम की जमकर तारीफ की और उन्होंने ये भी बताया कि वो आरसीबी को हारते हुए देखकर कितने निराश थे what's happening after this sunday night because it's all been indian premier league so far um you know been over here covering the whole ipl for um geo cinema which has been a lot of fun um so yeah once once this weekend's finished then no I'll, i'll take more of an interest was your ipl winner um i had rcb from from game 1 so i'm disappointed last night they got knocked out it's going to be hard to beat my old team kkr i think they probably the strongest team in the uh, competition and one last question uh brett we are of course uh, staying on the topic of the t20 world cup which are my deciding to take four spinners and you know in the press conference he said that he's going to keep it a mystery as to why uh he's taken four spinners can you decode it a bit uh, he said they will be useful in west indies oh look, i think if you think about the west indies and the ground and the conditions that will be on offer it will be low and slow you know we we you know we know that every time i've played over in the west indies you know the brand new ball carries through but it's it's sort of more you know low and slow so it definitely will suit the spin aur t20 world cup se pehle times network ne england ke pure star khiladi aur spinner swan se bhi khaas baat cheet ki is dauran unka kya kuch kehna hai ye bhi dekhiye aur rohit sharma decided to take four spinners with him uh, to usa and west indies and he very mysteriously said i will tell you in west indies why i did that but i think you're the best person who can decode it and or tell us why he would have done that i think it's very obvious uh, i think the pitches um a lot of them are new pitches a lot of them haven't had years and years of rolling so they might break up and they might spin and cricket in the in america and in the west indies has traditionally suited spin bowling as well in the recent past so i'm 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 really happy that yusuf chahal is in the team to be honest because i think he's been the best uh, the standout spinner for a decade in the ipl um bowling on some very unforgiving grounds um and now bowling so well for for Rajasthan um i think he deserves a chance at an icc uh, tournament um and if he doesn't play then he can come and play for england and say we'll have him and gram before i let you go quickly one your ipl winner and two top 4 for the t20 world cup uh in an ideal world um, i've always i've made no bones about it i support rajasthan um i love joss butler and i love uh, what he's done there i think they're a bit hamstrung by not having joss but you know they're going to be there or they're about um i don't think you can look past kkr at the minute they're playing some incredible cricket um they've qualified easily for the final um um and so kkr are the team to beat but i'd like to think that rajasthan come through and top 4 for the T20 World Cup your top four, four favorites or who you think are going to be there um you know i i'd say england will be there i think india will be there i hate to say it but australia will be um and uh, you know the west indies playing at home uh, they've got some incredible power players uh, their batting looks incredibly strong whether their bowling is as strong when we get over there we'll wait and see but i think that could be a good foursome to chale in khabron ke sath hi filhal 